Hi everybody and welcome back. Today is the day, it is Saturday, the day that I start my estrogen patches and my first PIO injections. My husband here is going to help me film and my little dude here is going to help me with my shot. So I'm going to pass the camera off to my hubby here and he's going to film me getting my shot set up. Alright, so this is a 22 gauge genome. This is what I'm going to be injecting the liquid with. And this is the 18 gauge, you know, is what I'm going to be drawing up the PIO with and the syringe. So we're going to open up these here. Oh, everything's going to fall out. That's okay. I'm going to attach the needle onto here, just like that. And we're going to open up this. This is the oil that I'm going to be using. And I have to peel this off here, I believe. Boop. All right, ready for the fun part? Because this is new, I'm not going to wipe this with an alcohol swab. But after the first use, you do have to wipe it out. Holy moly. <laughs> do you see that needle, guys? Thankfully, that is not going in my body. That is just going in for... It's not going to focus. But this is just going in for drying up my liquid. And I do have to do 2 milliliters, or whatever this is. I don't know. And we're just going to shove this right on in here. Oh wait, let's draw some air up first so we don't have any bubbles. Alright, shove that in. Alright, can you see that okay, babe? I'm going to push the air inside of it. And I'm going to draw it up. Oh, it's not drawing up. There we go. Alright, it doesn't seem to... Pull the needle out a little bit then. You're sucking up the top. Uh, that's weird. This is a different type of oil. I haven't used it, so you know, technical issues. This is a thicker oil, though. It's like I'm having a hard time sucking it up. But can we get it? Yep, there it goes. All right, so hmm. Let's put the air in. So let's do this again. Oh wait, maybe it's going to work this time. No, it's like it's... Alright, we're going to stop filming and I'll show you guys again once I get it filmed. Alright, we got it. The husband figured it out. Look at him go. Alright, this is not focusing. My camera sucks. I'm so sorry. But anyways, we're going to get this to number two. And then I have to warm up the oil so that it's easier to inject. So I'm going to do that and um, I'll show you guys how to put the patches on as well. Alright, so I'm just going to show you guys quickly how to just change the needles. We're going to put this cap back on. Twist this off. This is a new needle here. We're just going to shove it on in there. And twist it on. And there we have it. I'm going to warm it up. And we're going to start with our patches. So let me just put this in the air to be warm. <laughs> this is what our estrace patches look like, or estrogen patches. So the doctor says that I have to put on two. So there's this one and two. The nurse told me that I can place them either on my outer thighs, on my stomach, or on my back, my lower back, I believe. So I'm going to put them on my stomach because it's just easier for me. Just so I don't have to pull out my pants too much and, you know, where are these things? Oh, look at that. I've never done patches before, as if you've seen my, uh, my last journey. This is all new to me, so it's like clear. That's so different. Weird. All right, so I'm gonna just put on one for you guys so you can see. And I'm just gonna put it here, I guess. I have no idea what I'm doing here. Is this how I do it? It looks like it. Yeah, I'm gonna circle things over. All right, so I'm just gonna like pop it here. Yeah. This is so weird. All right, and we're just gonna pretend that I'm putting a label on something and there you have it there's one patch i gotta do one more and then i'll do more. i'll show you just my injection because i'm running out of memory on my phone all right we'll be back with the injection in a minute all right so i don't have a lot of time here so this is going to be quick this is the alcohol swab the nurse has kindly putting circles of where i need to do my injection so i'm just going to clean that area here let it dry. You know, this is the 22 gauge you know that I'm going to inject with. Yes, hold on one second. I gotta pull it off. Oh, 
There we are. Much smaller, but still intimidating. I forgot how, like, oh my gosh, this is. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to get a little bit in there. Do, 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 do. Come on. Where is your oil? There you go. There's a little bit drop. That hurts. Yep. The little guy here is going to push this liquid in. Okay, push it in, baby. Daddy's going to help. This process does take quite Oops. some time. Here, just hold the needle, okay? I'll push. Yep, I'm holding that. This is a very thick liquid, so it takes a little time to get in there. Oh my god, I feel it. Oh, lordy day. Okay, let's see, Ethan. Let me do some it's and then... It's warm. Better if you're like laying down or something. Well, yeah, I usually am laying down when I do this, but... I figured I'd try standing up because a lot of people do it standing up. I'm a little bit chunkier this time around too, so hopefully it doesn't hurt as bad. So far it's actually not too bad. I'm going to move my hand so you can see a bit more. Keep it. No, keep your hand out. I can't stay still. Oh, yeah, my foot flat. Hold on. There. All right. <laughs> Anything you want to do some? Okay, not too hard. Not too hard. <laughs> just like, I'm just going to shove yeah, the exactly. as far yeah. there okay. as I can get put, it, Mama. Put pressure. Push hard, a little harder. It's hard to push, isn't it? You want to go slow, though, okay? So push a little harder. Not too hard, though. All right, the liquid is all in. So Ethan, slowly pull the needle. Oh, okay, just rip it out. There we go. You can see that part there. There's actually nothing dripping. Normally, there's a little bit of stuff coming out. So you just put a little cotton swab there. So that is how you do a PIO injection. The little guy still hold on to the needle. So let's not do that. Um, so yeah, this this uh, series of videos for my second journey is going to be quite different from my first series. It's not going to be all total sit downs. You're going to see the raw of everything. Um, if it starts to hurt, you're going to show you that. So at the very end of my last journey with my needles, I started crying with every needle because of the pain. If that happens this time, you're going to see it. I'm going to show the raw, the truth of everything that is going on that happens. And all of that good stuff, so you can see, I mean, not that the last journey, you didn't see the real stuff, because you did, but um, this is going to be even more in-depth of stuff. So we do transfer on Thursday, December 12th, so I'm going to, hopefully, if I can, record that, and we will go from there. Alright, bye, thanks for watching.